Are your pegs slipping? If so, there are two simple things you can do to start with to try to fix this problem. The first thing is to always push the peg into the peg box as you're turning. The peg might look like it's straight, but it's actually conical, like a waffle cone. As you push, you push the wider part of the peg into the peg box, and it's more likely to stay. One addendum I'd like to make is that there is peg dope or peg paste that will help your pegs stay put or also turn more smoothly. They magically work in both directions. But 99 times out of 100, you just have to push the peg in harder. It's not enough to put your finger on the other side of the scroll and you know try to do it like that. They're not like guitar pegs. You really have to push. So hold the scroll in one hand and with your other hand, at first I pluck the string and really you know, use your muscles. Really push, push. Okay, um, and like you should have an imprint in your hand from, from doing it. I know I'm being silly, but I'm dead serious. Like you have to push it in harder. The second option is a little bit of a fancy move. If there's currently a gap between the end of the string and the peg box, then unwind the peg and then rewind it closer to the peg box so that eventually the end of the string is pinched against the peg box wall. This doesn't affect the sound at all because the string only vibrates between the nut and the bridge anyways. It adds a little bit of friction so that the peg is less likely to slip. So I hope that was helpful for you. And thanks for visiting fiddlershop.com.